Hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück bei Great Hell Games Staffel 2 mit der ersten Staffel von Batman The Telltale Series. Er ist zurück mit Episode 2, die Kinder von Arkham, heißt sie. Und ja, tatsächlich ist ja das Spiel beim letzten Mal in der Vorschau für Episode 2 abgestürzt. Das heißt, ich weiß tatsächlich nicht viel, was uns erwarten wird. Ja, und wir starten die Episode mal gleich. Ohne viel vorreden. Hier hatten wir nochmal unser Zuvor bei Batman. A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Together, we will change Gotham. Harvey Dent. Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicky Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Your father knew which hands to shake. <coughs> Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. This is Selena. How many? I'd have to count the pieces. Falcone's calling card. The chemicals. Where are they? We're all being played in, including you. It's the Waynes. <coughs> well, the Waynes are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. <laughs> ja, und mit diesem Cliffhanger hat uns das Spiel zuletzt zurückgelassen. Er hat dann noch Alf äh, Alfred äh, konfrontiert. Und ja, jetzt äh, schauen wir mal, wie das Ganze hier weitergeht, ne? Mir hat die erste Episode im Gegensatz zu vielen ja sehr, sehr gut gefallen. In der Presse und bei vielen Spielern ist sie ja eher so mittelmäßig angekommen. Und wir sind offenbar... Und Zweifeln versunken. Ah, an der Stelle, wo die Waynes erschossen wurden. In der Crime Alley, natürlich. I thought I might find you here. The news was upsetting for both of us. But you should see this. I know you come here for solitude, Bruce. More allegations about his ties to the underworld. This isn't going away. It's all so public and messy. Also, am passendsten finde ich jetzt A. Tell me, all of this is a lie. I wish I could. There are no angels in Gotham, Bruce. Maybe there never were. Hmm. I've been dreading this day for nearly two decades. I, I hoped it would never come. Forget the papers. I want to hear it from you. The truth is, they were billionaires, Bruce. You can't amass that kind of wealth without making certain moral compromises. It's just not possible. That kind of money taints you. You kept their secrets for them. I'm trying to help you understand. Then try harder! <laughs> Hill greased the wheels of politics. Falcone was the muscle. Thomas legitimized the whole enterprise with his name. Your father, Hamilton Hill, and Falcone, they were partners. Nothing happened in Gotham without them knowing. 
Falcone, the papers, they were telling the truth. Everyone knew about this but me. I know it's a lot to take in. I want you to know I had my suitcases ready. I couldn't stand to be around your father anymore. But then they were killed, and you were all alone. And I just couldn't walk out the door. Everything I did, everything I've ever done, was out of love for you. I hope you can forgive me. How could I hold this against you? You're all I've got, Alfred. Thank you. I won't let you down again. This is the first time I've been back here since that night. When the police called me to collect you, I thought they'd finally arrested your father. I couldn't believe a low-life thug like Joe Chill would have the audacity to rob and kill Thomas Wayne. He was simply too well known. Too... too big. Yet, there it was. If my father was that deep in crime, he would have no. had enemies. Well, it's a fair assumption. You don't think. You always said it was it's a simple money. Mod. In 20 years, you've never wavered from that story. I can recall every moment of that night in vivid detail. But maybe that's wrong. Sometimes we block out things we don't want to face. Maybe there was some detail I overlooked. Okay. Ähm, ich muss sagen, ich finde diesen Ansatz, den sie hier fahren, dass die Waynes halt auch Dreck abstecken hatten und so, beziehungsweise also Thomas Wayne, ähm, ja, und dass, dass diese berühmte ähm, Background-Story von, von Batman, wo ja mittlerweile eigentlich jeder sagt, oh, ich kann sie nicht mehr sehen, wo ich sage, gut, es gibt aber auch immer wieder Leute, die neu in Batman einsteigen, deswegen muss man die Origins-Story auch oft wieder zeigen. Ähm... Ja, und dass sie das jetzt alles so ein bisschen umdrehen, finde ich äh, interessant. So, wir gucken uns das Kino an. Ja, verzeiht, wenn ich immer noch mal kurz huste. Ganz fit bin ich noch nicht wieder. How long did it play there? Only when you wanted to see it, Bruce. Your mother arranged the special screenings personally. I never knew that. She was always so good to me. Yeah, my graffiti. thought he was invincible. Sadly, he was mistaken. I always wanted to be brave, just like him. And you are. He would be so proud to see that you took a different path. Possibility is a frightening. Hmm. I'd only want to ask him one question. Why? My parents could have given him anything. Why would he just shoot them? He was stabbed to death in prison. Interessant, dass die... for Joe Chill, Bruce. Interessant, dass es die Auswahl gegeben hätte, ihn das wir ihn töten würden, wenn wir ihn jetzt in Gefängnis exactly würden. Where does the memory end? With my father pleading. You don't have to do this. 
and the gun fires. And after that? Uh, there are considerable gaps in that recollection. Maybe. Do I really want to know? Okay, jetzt kann man nur noch in eine Richtung gehen. <lacht> Sind wir nicht eben noch von da gekommen? Okay. Irgendwas eingesammelt. Geschäftsbuch oder sowas. Aber das soll das die Brieftasche sein. Bruce, are you all right? It wasn't a mug. They were assassinated. And Carmine Falcone knows why. Ja, wie gesagt, sehr, sehr spannender Story-Ansatz. see Falcone like this? I don't have to tell you how many rules we're breaking. <laughs> no, don't get me wrong, I'm always here for you, but this guy led us both in hot water. I pulled all the strings I had with the lieutenant. Better not come back to bite us. Look, I get that, Harv, okay? And it means a lot to me. I know it does, Bruce. It doesn't make it any easier. The last time we brushed shoulders with Falcone, the press made us pay. At least tell me what this is about. Look, I'm all for blind support, but I should at least know what I'm getting myself into. Trust me, you don't want to know. No, no, I do. That's why I'm asking. I don't ask questions I don't want to know the answers to. I'm sorry, Arby. It's better this way. Fine, fine, don't tell me. But I hope none of this comes back to bite us. I don't want headlines taking away from my debate with Hill. Dent, Mr. Wayne. Welcome to the GCPD. Thank you, Lieutenant. Now, ordinarily, we'd never let you in to see Falcone, but it uh, must be nice to have a DA in your pocket, Mr. Wayne. Bend the rules whenever you need it. I realize this is irregular, Lieutenant. I wouldn't ask if there was another way. I'm vouching for him, Gordon. Trust me, he's one of the good guys. A good guy who always gets what they want. Now, in my book, there's no such thing. Nice job bringing in Falcone. Yeah, that son of a bitch better not get off again. He's not getting off the hook, Rene. Not this time. Mr. Wayne, Sergeant Rene Montoya. I just wanted <laughs> to say, you know, some of us police support you, despite what the media is saying. Und wenn ich Batman bin, schießt du auf mich. Keeping Falcone in the infirmary. He's lucky he didn't get roughed up more. I could tell Batman wanted to kill him, but he held back. He cares about doing the right thing. I know he does a lot for the department, but honestly, Batman freaks me out. Oh, he's definitely freaky. But I'm glad he's out there watching over the city. 
nicht, nicht zu positiv über ihn reden. Zumindest nicht vor der Polizei. Episode 2 Kinder von Arkham The hell? Bruce Wayne? You must have some clout. My own wife can't get in to see me. <laughs> Good thing I'll be out of here in a week. <laughs> Just like every other time they tried to put me away. We need to talk, Falcone. You weren't so eager the last time we met. But then, I knew you'd come around. Especially after the press got their teeth in you. <laughs> You're your father's son. Yeah, that's right. Tommy and I were close. More than friends. More like cousins. Going back decades. Did you have something to do with his death? Ah, so that's what this is really about, eh? The pop digging up a 20-year-old killer. Two killings, and they were never forgotten. You and me, we're practically family. I thought you'd have figured that out by now. I tried to get through to you at Dent's party. But you, you showed me the door. Got a whole closet full of birthday presents. Nee, ich will I was never was Sache ist. Convince me then. Tell me a story about our big happy family. <laughs> There it is. Now I got you hooked. Your father, Hill, and me. We ran this city. Still do. <clears throat> God damn this pain. Can't think through it. Morphine's on the side there. Be a good boy and help Uncle Carmine out, huh? Muss <sighs> man. Nicht, dass das jetzt irgendeine Todesspritze oder so ist. Ich will wissen, was Sache ist. Forty years I keep my veins clean of any of that gunk. But you never forget the tender kiss. It'd be so easy to give me the whole vial, wouldn't it? Enough there to put an old dog down forever. Because you'd never know the whole story. How much of your parents do you have in you? What kind of son did Thomas Wayne make? I'm not a murderer. No, you're not. That's why you were kept in the dark. Much better, kid. Thank you. <laughs> Just you like that reminds me of your mother. Your father may have been the doctor, but Martha, she had the human touch. I think you got more of her in you, tell the truth. Yeah, there's a kindness in you. Ach, schon, das spricht selten über sie, ne? <laughs> Even schweig es einfach like me. <laughs> She was the only one that ever had a hold on your father. Until you hired an assassin to kill them both. What, you really think I hired Chill? Sure. I worked with Joe Chill from time to time. Put a button on someone, he'd take him out. But I never ordered that hit on your parents. So who did? You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friends. Your parents learned that the They're waiting for you in hell! What? The bastard had to die! Hands in the air! Stand down! Get a doctor! Secure this floor! No one gets in or out! Go! Go! 
Alter, es geht ja gleich richtig heftig los. Okay. Ähm, und beim nächsten Mal, in der nächsten Folge, werden wir dann weitermachen in GCPD. Pff, was ein Auftakt. Also wenn Telltale was kann, dann sind es Auftakte und Enden von Episoden. Alter. Okay. Falconi ist tot. Aber wir waren es immerhin nicht. <lacht> ähm, ja, wir haben ein bisschen was erfahren, aber nicht das, was wir eigentlich wissen wollten. Und ja, jetzt muss Batman wohl einschreiten, um das auf anderen Wege herauszufinden. Und wir können vor allem nicht unseren Freunden vertrauen. Okay, ich freue mich, dass wir Episode 2 spielen und wir sehen uns dann in der nächsten Folge. Bis dann, euer Rauton. Ciao.